Maybe I forgot to press record again. See, I'm not as accurate as I used to be. Um, <coughs> well, uh, it's like Dad said about certain people. Just ignore them and they'll defeat themselves. They are not defeated. They're idiotic. Yeah, what are we going to do? Send the lads around. I'm sorry, lads. You, you'll defeat yourself before you get here. <coughs> I mean, that's the thing. Um, <coughs> they're like Hitler. Or is it them who's related to Hitler? Oh, I say, yeah. That's why they're self-defeating. They take on, on more than they can, than they can chew. Bite off my licking chew, take on my licking lick them, they lick can lick lick tackle. And, uh, well, you know, I mean, uh, so I've been put in the, um, in the mental health system deliberately to uh, to punish me. Well, that's the thing, lads, you know, when you want me to sing for you now, do you? Well, I don't even notice, but my voice is terrible now because of all the years in the mental health system. It's what it does to you. <laughs> you know, as I, as, as, as I say, you know, I was born in a maternity hospital. I'm terrible now. So you're wasting your bloody time. You've defeated yourselves, you idiots. And uh, somebody once said, how does he know that? Well, I went, to, I went to work, and I worked. I went to college, and I worked, and I did my own work, and I can work things out. But then, I'm, I mean, I can't really prove that I've got um, diagnostic techniques, but my half-brother's dad was a police inspector. And from what I've heard, he inspected her as well, yeah. I and mean, then my mother said, you know, he, 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 he had an affair behind the back, but soon she found out it was history. Down the road, goodbye. She just divorced him and told him where to go. And that's the thing. I, I mean, suppose she wouldn't think like this, but um, yeah, he'd been posted to uh, France in World War Two, And, um, well, I don't know what went on there, but I've heard about um, in World War One and World War Two, occasionally the soldiers, if they were sad to suffer from shell shock, they literally sent behind, um, uh, sent into, into France and um, sent to a prostitute. So they could have caught diseases and all sorts, but that's the thing, I don't know whether that happened, but um, it's what he saw while he was in France. You know, was, my brother used to say, if a bomber limped home after it had been shot up, um, well, the Messerschmitts fired cannon shells, they had cannons. Eventually, the Spitfires had two cannons, but for, for, for as far as I can remember, every gun on a Messerschmitt was actually a cannon they don't fire bullets, they fire exploding shells. And if you're hit by one of them, there's not much left of you. But the thing is, they'd go straight through the uh, canvas uh, bodywork body of a hurricane and straight through and out the other side. And sometimes if they hit the, the wooden framework, they wouldn't explode. But uh, yeah, I mean, with Spitfires, there were aluminium, uh, all the panels had to be drilled off, riveted, ri dr rivets at the driller rivets out take the panel off, make a new panel and rivet it back on where there's with a hurricane. If they got a, bu a bullet straight through, they literally, literally, it's literally like gluing a patch onto, onto the fuselage. It was de dead quick to repair. But uh, yeah, I mean, um, that's what my brother used to say. If, the, if, the, if a bomber had been shot up and it actually made it back, um, the, there were only bits of the crew that had been hit by these exploding shells. And they, they literally used to put a big hose in. in it was usually the, the tail gunner got it worst. Because he was the worst, most manoeuvrable, and once they'd been taken out, the plane was blind from behind, so they could attack from behind and take all the other gunners out. And that was the thing. Um, he said if if one if one limped back and there were dead crew in, the, the, the literally they put a hose pipe, a big hose pipe, into the turret and hosed all the bits and blood out. I mean, if you've seen something like that, You're not going to be the same again? <laughs>